Jesus' name. Everybody be seated. Dearly beloved, we are gathered together here today to celebrate 50 years of marriage between Jesse and Alva Jean Brown. In the time that we live, this is a great accomplishment and a tremendous honor. True love, God's love, will stand the test of time. The test of pain, of loss, of ups and downs, of poverty and luxury, <coughs> sickness and in health, and it will endure forever. Such is the love of God. Oh my, I'm just thinking. This is not in my notes, but I'm just thinking. I was just a little boy, and we lived down the street. Now that we lived on 1218 Warner Avenue, and Alvin and Jesse lived up the hill. And we'd run up there and play with, me and Kevin would play with uh, Dustin and, Dar uh, and Darren. And uh, we'd ride our motorcycles out there. And, and we'd run up there because you, you always had something good to eat. <laughs> and your kids would run down because mom had something good to eat. And uh, I, I just think that Jeepers, that was, that was 40 years ago more. Wow. More than 40 years, probably 42 years ago. It's just amazing. And here they stand still together, glory be to God. By the grace of God, amen. Take today as we are gathered together, we will fan the flames of a seasoned love as Jesse and Alva Gene renew their wedding vows. First Corinthians 13, 4 to 8. I believe that's what's kept this marriage together. Love is very patient and kind. Never jealous or envious or boastful or proud. Never haughty or selfish or rude. Love does not demand its own way. It is not irritable or touchy. It does not hold grudges. Will hardly even notice when others do it wrong. It is never glad about injustice, but rejoices whenever truth wins out. If you love someone, you will be loyal to him no matter what the cost. You will always believe in him, always expect the best of him, and always stand your ground in defending him. All the special gifts and powers from God will someday come to an end. But love goes on. Forever. Someday our bodies will wear out, but our spirits will never wear out. Someday this life will end, but this love will go on forever, even into eternity. This kind of love has brought you to this place today and will carry you on through everything that comes your way. Do you, Jesse Bratton, renew your love to Alda Jean today? Do you promise to love, honor, and cherish her through the rest of the years that God gives you together? He didn't even hesitate. <laughs> Do you, Alda Jean Bratton, renew your love to Jesse this day? Do you promise to love and honor him throughout all the rest of the years that God gives you together. As a minister of the gospel, I pronounce that your marriage is renewed. <laughs> and I pray that the blessings of the Lord will rest upon you all the days of your lives. That your love will even now bud and grow fresh in a new way and that God's hand will be upon you and bless you and all that you do together. In the name of the Father, Son, and the Holy Spirit, and all that agree, said, Amen. Amen. You may kiss your bride again. <laughs> One million times. Uh, at this time, the... Uh, some of the grandchildren are going to come and they have something.
Evidently, somebody likes ding dongs and Cheetos. <laughs> <laughs> Reese's. He likes that with Grandpa. Oh, you like them, I bet. Jesse's got enough st stacks here to last him for a while. One day. <laughs> One day. Isn't that precious? Yeah. Well, remember that next time you're mad. <laughs> <laughs> Let's give them an upper hand. <laughs> you know, I believe that the anointing of the Lord is on you as to bring your family into that ark. And you know your prayers. You know, the God the Lord says he'll, he'll never forget our prayers. Our prayers are stored in in vials in heaven, and uh, sometimes we we even go on and to heaven, but our prayers keep working on those that are still on the earth. So never give up, Alvin and Jesse. Your prayers are working on your family. Amen. Bless you. Well, let's have a prayer over the. Oh, I want you to say here. The first time I got married, I did not have a bouquet. Now I 